So today is room clean out day, which basically means that I'm getting ready to redo my room and paint the walls. And if you guys have seen my room before, and this is my room at my parents' house, by the way, then you'll know that there are a whole bunch of uh, paintings that I did. Here is a buffalo named Jeffrey. He was the first one I painted. Uh, there's Matt Smith and a jellyfish mobile. There's a chinchilla named Carl. There's a picture of my face that Yin took for a college project. There's Norma, the giraffe. Stel Maria, which is Panther. And yeah, these are the mirrors. And yeah, that's my attractive outfit today. Yeah, I know that's really a, really an attractive look for anybody. This is the tiny goat, which has a history. This is the platypus fernald. Here are some paintings that I did for my college class. Edward Scissorhands, uh, the one that I painted while I was laying in bed at 2 a.m. because it was the last day and I still had two paintings to do. Or maybe it's three, I don't really remember. Uh, yeah, there's Dostoevsky. I painted my room when I was about maybe 14, 13, somewhere in there. And what I'm gonna be doing is I'm going to be painting it a silverish gray and then I'm going to be doing, uh, for my bed sheets, they're going to be a dark red and I'm gonna hopefully be making some curtains instead of having these bamboo blinds. Um, I used to have a jungle themed bedroom before this when I was like 10, nine, something like that. Either way, um, it was pretty cool actually because I really liked frogs and there were, there, I had a really cool uh, bedpost thing that my grandpa made out of trees and that proved to be kind of dangerous when it fell on me. But it was pretty interesting at least, it kept me on my toes. So I guess my next theme is going to be adults themed? I don't know, relaxing? Because I feel like the way it looks now sort of reflects who I used to be and not who I am right now. So, you know, as you get older, your tastes change. And I mean, my room's cute and whatnot, but it's time for me to renovate a little bit. So it's time to say goodbye to the Jellyfish Mobile. Jellyfish Mobile, which it glows in the dark, which was pretty cool. Um, love Jellyfish. Matt Smith creeping in the background. That Matt Smith over there acts a scout for me for my 20th birthday. And every time I come into the room, he scares the crap out of me because all I see is this dark shadow. And so I uh, gasp and I'm looking at it. And then I say, oh, Matt Smith. <laughs> and then I'll wake up in the middle of the night and I'll see him just looking at me. And his eyes kind of follow you. Oh my gosh, they really do. Watch this. Right now we're standing directly in front of him, okay? Look, his eyes are still looking at me. Let me get even like sideways. Yeah. He still looks like he's looking. Matt Smith's time is not done. Um, perhaps in this room. But I know that he will find a home in maybe my apartment. Uh, maybe the butt of a couple of good pranks, I'm hoping. Yeah, so. I will have to update when I actually have my room done, which is going to be a while. Yeah. Yo. I'm such a serious film, whoa, such a serious film student. Okay, yes. So I will update when I've actually done something besides get rid of my entire childhood. I was carrying this giant garbage bag and I was thinking if my dad stopped me and said, you know, what do you even have in there? I would say the remains of my childhood and then keep walking, which I thought was pretty funny. Yep, bye.